Hello, welcome back to my kitchen and today I am going to share my favorite recipe. It transports me back home. When we were growing up in India, my mother used to make leg of goat for special occasions. But of course, she did not have oven back then. So she used pressure cooker. Now we all have ovens. So I'm going to bake this yummy leg of goat. It's a two part process. Today I'm going to marinate it and then we'll bake it. Here's my two pound leg peas. Here are the spices. And here is the tenderizer department. Papaya, kachri powder, and lime juice. This will help to tenderize the meat and break down the meat. Let's begin by making small slits. So the marinade can go inside, seep in. I have made enough slits. Next thing is my fork. I'm going to prick it. Tiny holes. So we do the same thing. We flip it. This will allow all the masala to get in the mutton to make it so delicious. Finger licking good. So set this aside. In this bowl, I'm going to assemble all the marinade. First, I'll get my spices. Oil, lime juice, and last, yogurt. And now we're going to pour this marinade. And I have to use my hands. Massage it. Gently. Needs to be massaged. And flip it. I'm going to prick it with a big fork now. So all the marinade can seep in and make it yummy. Oh, I remember. It used to be so delicious when my mom used to make it. Next, I'm going to cover it and put this baby in the fridge for 48 hours. And then I'm going to take it out and bake it. It's going to be so delicious. See ya! This baby has been sleeping for 40 hours. It's time to wake her up. Let's take the covers off and poke her. Poke her some more. Next step, I'll take this whole leg and transfer it to this dish, my baking dish. To this, I'm going to put some potatoes. The potatoes are going to cook with the juice of the mutton and all the marinade. They'll turn out to be so delicious. Then I'm going to pour some juice on the potatoes or aloo. So now I'm going to cover it. And it's going to cook for two hours in the oven at 350 degrees. The temperature is 350 degrees. In it goes and I'm going to check it in an hour. So on my stove I have a skillet heating up. Don't throw the rest of the marinade. We are going to cook it down and it's going to turn out so juicy. I added a teaspoon of butter and let it melt. And your sauce is totally ready. So here's the final product. Look at this. Oh, it smells delicious. My whole leg of goat. Let me taste it. Oh, 
look at that. Mmm, delicious. Thank you so much for watching my videos. And for all my recipes, please go to shebasrecipes.com. Thank you once again. And if you want to cook this in pressure cooker, you have to cook it for an hour. Bye.